Welcome to this year's recap where we talk about the top 10 most read stories on Channel 24 for the year 2013. It wouldn't be a recap list without talking about the Beebs, so let's get right into it. Coming in at number 10, a prostitute reveals the size of Justin Bieber's manhood. We all remember the infamous trip the singer took to Brazil where he supposedly visited a brothel and one of those young ladies revealed that the size of his manhood was, well, average. Coming in at number 9, TV presenter Voyom Bully dies. The TV presenter died of a sudden heart attack in May, leaving friends and family shocked. And coming in at number 8 was a silly article we did using photos from the Wallace Annenberg Center for Performing Arts inaugural gala. The photos were of Charlize Theron and Demi Moore, and let's face it, this article had no global importance, but it's always good to have a little laugh. And coming in at number 7, who doesn't like a little bit of nudity? This article showcased 5 photos of Thor actress Jamie Alexander, basically nude on the red carpet. Coming in at number 6, the latest news on actor Paul Walker's death. We'll all remember that fiery car crash in November that claimed the life of the actor far too soon. Coming in at number 5, we're halfway there and there's already another penis story on the list. This time it was Samsung with their naughty billboard that was erected in Pakistan, Kenya, Egypt and France. For those of you who didn't see the billboard, it said the penis mightier than the finger. Although this caused quite a stir, turns out it was all a hoax. And coming in at number 4, a friend reveals Riva's love triangle. This friend came out and said just three days before Riva started her relationship with Oscar, she had ended a serious relationship with a well-known rugby player. Coming in at number 3, another Vuillaume Bully story. This time his estranged wife lashed out at presenter Cooley Roberts and accused her of being one of the 18 women to commit adultery with the late Mboli during their marriage. Coming in at number 2, another Riva story. This time it was about the semi-naked photos that emerged on the same day that Oscar's trial was postponed. The black and white photos were commissioned by the late model just months before she passed and were said to be for a special someone. And the most read story for 2013 was... A beautiful flash mob in honor of Tata Madiva. The flash mob took place amongst the aisles of a Woolworth store in Parkdale and was a tribute to the late icon by the Soweto Gospel Choir. That's a wrap on 2013. I can't wait to see what the new year has in store for us. I hope you guys all have a great New Year's Eve and catch you in 2014.